Hello students, let's have some fun with painting by sound. We are going to look at soft C and hard C and soft G and hard G. So we are going to make light blue, hard C, hard G will be black, soft G will be gray, and soft C will be orange. So let's see if we can, let's start up in the bottom left hand corner. K at, cat, C A T. There is an A after the C, and it is not an exception, so we know that this color will be light blue. All right. Let's go to the next one to the right. Crow. Crow. C R O W. We know that there's an R after the C, and it's not an exception, so this one too will be light blue. Next animal. Raccoon. R A C C O O N. There's two C's. One is followed by a C. One is followed by an O. Neither is followed by an I, E, or Y, so it's a hard C and is there for light blue. Now this next one is lice. L-I-C-E. The C is followed by an E and is not an exception, so it is a soft C and will therefore be orange. The next one, mice. M-I-C-E. The C is followed by an E. It's not an exception, and therefore it's orange. All right, the next one, duck, D-U-C-K. The C is followed by a K, and will therefore be light blue. Next one, pig, P-I-G, G, G. The G is followed by no letter, is this therefore a hard G, and will be black. Next one, grasshopper. The G is followed by an R, is a hard G, and will therefore be black. Locus. This one has a C instead of a G. It's followed by a U and not an I, E, or Y, so it will be a hard C. Chick. Now there's two C's, but the first one is part of a CH blend and doesn't count, and the second C is followed by a K, not an I, E, or Y, so it will be light blue. The next one is goat, G, oat. It's a G, followed by an O, not an I, E, or Y, and so it's a hard G. The next one is gypsy moth. The G is followed by a Y, therefore it will be gray. The next one over is partridge, P-A-R-T-R-I-D-G-E. The G is followed by an E and is therefore soft and therefore light gray. The next one over, magpie. The G is followed by a P, it's therefore hard and black. The next one over is dog, D-O-G. The, the G is followed by no letter, Therefore, it's hard and black. The next word is colt, C-O-L-T. The C is followed by an O and is therefore a hard C and light blue. All right, going back to the beginning, we have crow, C-R-O-W. The C is followed by an R and not an I, E, or Y and is therefore blue. The next one is dog. The G is not followed by any letter and is therefore hard and black. Badger. Badger. The G is followed by an E, therefore soft and gray. Whoopsie. Soft and gray. The next one is bug. Bug. The G is followed by no letter, is therefore hard and black. Next one is cow. The C is followed by an O, it's therefore hard, hard C, and blue. Now the next one in line is pigeon. So G is followed by an E in pigeon. Therefore it's a soft G and gray. And duck. 
The C is followed by a K in duck, it's therefore a hard C, and blue. Cat, going back to the left hand side, C A T. The C is followed by an A and not an I E or Y, and therefore blue. Next one, pig, P ig. The G is followed by no letter and is therefore hard and black. And the next one is pig again. G is followed by no letter, not I, E, or Y, is therefore hard and black. Cat, C, A, T. The C is followed by an A and is therefore hard and blue. And in the little, in the little one in the middle, you see M, I, C, E. The C is followed by an E. It's therefore soft and orange. Now on the far left hand side we have a k k cow, C, followed by an O, it's blue. Bacteria, C is followed by a T, therefore hard and blue. Buck, C is followed by a K, therefore hard and blue. And the final one is goat, where the G is followed by an O, it's therefore hard and black. And what animal do we have here? We have a penguin, E-N-G-U-I-N-S. So it's a hard G, penguins. The G is followed by a U, it's therefore a hard G, penguin. I hope you enjoyed this. You can, you can find this coloring sheet on the, on, on the link uh, provided with the Google, Google links with the rest of the class. Enjoy!